And I wonder too, with you know, what's what's really interesting to me to hear about this is is integrating things like this into animistic practices uh, or, or or shamanic practices, things that are very almost entirely like nature based. You know, connecting to the ground, the you know, getting your bare feet on the ground. You know, uh, uh, recognizing and connecting with spirit that exists in everything. How how much do you see that um, as, as as benefit as it could be? Do, do you feel like there's a risk in pushing too far on the technomancy or the cybermancy side of things and having those modern advances overshadow or take over the the purity almost or the or the base uh, benefits of these these, these old ways. I, th I think there's a distinct uh, threat if they were, if they were forgotten, if they were eliminated, if they were uh, if it was made the only option, if technology was isolated away from the natural world completely. Of course, we would be losing yeah. something very, very, very important. The way I look at, I, I will say to to kind of balance my previous statement is that I view the world similar to Alan Watts in the way that we are nature and what comes from us is also natural. It's it's just an expression of compounds and, and chemicals and all that. Yeah. But I do feel that um, we we could lose everything if we if we don't heed the words of the Amazonian tribes that we are now responsible for the planet. They can no longer do it themselves. We are now responsible as Western world, first world folk. We have taken that on and we have done so much damage to our planet that if we were to lose it um good luck we have to blame. yeah right yeah yeah who do you have to who else do we have to blame except ourselves That's right. for that so you you've you've entered into this uh approach in your paganism and then i've have shared this with others from the sounds of it um where this there's this integration of a healthy integration right that you you found this this beneficial blend of the two mm -hmm. So can you walk us through some examples of that? Um, I know you mentioned before, right, like divination and I think, and, and I'm, I'm not going to say it exactly, but and you can correct me and kind of walk me through, but something about predictive text uh, or, or text into something for divinatory purposes, okay. like with tarot readings. I'm, I'm, I'm losing a little bit of the, the details, but if you could, could we come back to that specifically? Because I'm kind of intrigued and interested on uh, what you found with that. Sure. Uh, yes, I would say the I would say probably the most relatable example is the tarot readings uh, app. I guess you could call it that I that I built uh, for for a computer. Uh, it's not for a cell phone. It's for a just for a computer web interface, and you can set it to do one, or you can set it to do five hundred million tarot reads in a second, and it will do five hundred million tarot reads in a second. Uh, kind of thing, maybe not specifically a thousand milliseconds, but it will do tens of millions of tarot reads very, very, very quickly, and then give you a summary of uh, the average cards and their placement as an example of what you can do with this application. That's just one approach, and that's just doing an unusually number, an unusually high number of tarot readings, and then summarizing the whole of it. Or you could use uh, a tool that I built for a uh, a group of occultists in a forum, which I can share a link to if you'd like me to. Uh, the name, I don't know, if, do you mind if I share the name of their uh, community? You are muted. Sorry about that. I uh, I did mute because I wanted to let you talk. Yeah, that's totally fine. Please, um, anything that gets shared here for the listeners and viewers, um, as long as you have freedom to share and, and can point to, you know, for people to check it out, then by all means, please do. I believe the website is uh, moneyritual.online is the website, the little dinky website that I built just to try it out. They love it. And it, it seems to be working for them because they keep coming back according to the analytics. So uh, it's... Yeah, analytics don't lie. That looks so 